Certainly. Cape Town, located in South Africa, is a city rich in history, natural beauty and cultural diversity. Here's an overview of its history, landmarks, visitor attractions, and a suggestion for a documentary. History. Early inhabitants. The area around Cape Town has been inhabited for thousands of years by indigenous Khoisan peoples. They were later displaced by the arrival of European settlers. Dutch colonization. In 1652, the Dutch East India Company established a refreshment station at the Cape of Good Hope, laying the foundation for Cape Town. The settlement grew as a trading post and agricultural centre. British rule, Cape Town came under British control in the early 19th century, after the Napoleonic Wars. The British influence is evident in many of the city's landmarks and institutions. Apartheid era. Like the rest of South Africa, Cape Town was deeply affected by apartheid policies, which enforced racial segregation and discrimination. District 6, a vibrant multicultural neighborhood, was forcibly cleared under Apartheid's Group Areas Act. Post-apartheid era. Since the end of apartheid in the early 1990s, Cape Town has transformed into a multicultural and cosmopolitan city, known for its democratic institutions, stunning landscapes, and vibrant culture. Landmarks and visitor places won. Table Mountain, a prominent landmark overlooking the city, offering breathtaking views of Cape Town and the surrounding area. Visitors can hike or take a cable car to the summit. 2. Robben Island, a UNESCO World Heritage Site and former political prison where Nelson Mandela and other anti-apartheid activists were incarcerated. Guided tours offer insights into South Africa's struggle for freedom. 3. V&A Waterfront a bustling waterfront area with shops, restaurants, entertainment venues, and cultural attractions such as the Two Oceans Aquarium and the Zeitz Museum of Contemporary Art Africa, MOCA. 4. Cape of Good Hope, a scenic nature reserve at the southern tip of the Cape Peninsula, known for its rugged coastline, pristine beaches, and diverse flora and fauna. 5. Bokap, a colorful neighborhood famous for its brightly painted houses, cobbled streets, and Cape Malay heritage. Visitors can explore its rich cultural history and sample traditional Cape Malay cuisine. 6. Kirstenbosch National Botanical Garden, one of the most beautiful botanical gardens in the world, showcasing South Africa's rich plant diversity against the backdrop of Table Mountain. 7. District 6 Museum, commemorating the forced removals and displacement of residents during apartheid, the museum documents the history and culture of the area. Documentary a comprehensive documentary that captures the history, culture and beauty of Cape Town is Cape Town, produced by National Geographic. This documentary provides a captivating exploration of Cape Town's past and present, highlighting its natural wonders, diverse communities and complex history, including the impact of apartheid and the city's journey toward reconciliation and transformation. Cape Town offers stunning cinematography, insightful interviews and engaging storytelling providing viewers with a deeper understanding of Cape Town's significance within the context of South Africa's broader story. It celebrates the city's resilience, cultural richness, and spirit of unity in the face of historical challenges. You can find Cape Town certainly. Let's dive deeper into some aspects of Cape Town's history, landmarks, visitor attractions, and culture. History, slave trade. Cape Town played a significant role in the transatlantic slave trade during the colonial period. Slaves were brought to the Cape from various parts of Africa and Asia, contributing to the city's cultural diversity. District 6. This vibrant neighborhood was declared a whites-only area under apartheid, leading to the forced removal and displacement of over 60,000 residents. Today, it stands as a symbol of resistance and resilience, with ongoing efforts to preserve its memory. Nelson Mandela and Robben Island, Nelson Mandela, South Africa's first democratically elected president, spent 18 of his 27 years in prison on Robben Island. The island has since become a symbol of South Africa's journey to democracy and is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site. End of Apartheid Cape Town witnessed significant anti-apartheid activism, including protests, boycotts and international pressure. The city played a pivotal role in the negotiations that led to the end of apartheid and the inauguration of Nelson Mandela as president in 1994. Landmarks and attractions, Signal Hill and Lion's Head. These iconic peaks offer stunning views of the city, 
Table Mountain and the Atlantic Ocean. Visitors often hike or drive to the summits to watch the sunset or enjoy a picnic. Cape Wineland's asterisk asterisk. Just outside of Cape Town lie Sever.